Hey, everybody, it's Lala. Hey, everybody, I hope everybody out there is doing good and great. I am doing good myself. I want to say to all of my subscribers and to my new subscribers, hey, hey. Hey, I thank y'all so much for subscribing and supporting my channel. I do appreciate that, y'all. And I want to say to everyone who have left comments under my videos, just expressing y'all thoughts and expressing y'all opinions and just speaking how y'all feel about whatever situation I may be speaking on, I want to say I do appreciate that, y'all. And I ask that y'all do keep it coming because you already know at the end of the day, your thoughts is your thoughts and your opinions is your opinions. My thoughts is my thoughts. And my opinions is mine's and it's just what it is. Anyways, y'all, I hope everybody out there is doing good and great. And I did say that before. I hope everybody is out there doing good and great. I hope everybody is, you know what I'm saying, keeping their hands clean and sanitized. You know what I'm saying? Staying safe from cocoa. Okay? And it's just real talk because, as I said before in my other video, y'all, it's really, you know what I'm saying? It's really serious. And it's really crazy, y'all, because it's like, how is all these people getting it? Sometimes I be thinking, and this is just me because I be overthinking it. Like, <laughs> I hope it's not coming from the food. You know what I'm saying? I hope it's not in the air because, to me, it's just like, how is this shit just spreading here and there and here, here? And you know what I'm saying? Some of these people saying they ain't been around nobody. Like, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just gotta, you know what I'm saying? Think what you come. common sense. It's crazy to me. And it's like, I hope... I don't know, y'all. You know. You know how sometimes you start overthinking, trying to figure shit out. And at the end of the day, nobody knows, okay? Anyway, y'all, let's jump into this reaction. Kind of off subject, you know what I'm saying? Might not be for some people because I know a lot of y'all like to hear about the mommies and what's going on. But you know what I'm saying? I'm finna to jump into, you know what I'm saying? Saying somebody that I watch, okay? A big YouTuber. And I watch them. And I started watching them from my baby, Okay? And at first, I was like, who is this couple? I'm not. But now, I catch myself, you know what I'm saying, going on there and looking up their channel and watching myself. And as a subscriber, because I am subscribed to them, y'all, and that's um, Beam Squad. Y'all, I watched a uh, video yesterday, and I also seen, I don't know if it was like a week ago. I don't know if it was like a week ago or two weeks ago. TMR did a reaction on them. And it's just like, I'm subscribed to them, y'all. That is like, I I used to, and y'all, I'm just, you know what I'm saying? This is a reaction, but I'm finna bring y'all in. For as, like, big YouTubers um, and the families, Prince Family. I used to always watch Prince Family. But more as they start getting even bigger, you know what I'm saying? They really starting to be, like, fake, fake. When, when you starting able to watch the YouTube video and you know the shit is fake or you know, like, damn, they title do not add up to what the hell the video is supposed to be about, I was just like, I can't, okay? I even try, but it's just like, I can't. So, you know, my kids be watching, like, Bean Squad, and especially my baby he used to watch Super Saiyan and all that. And then I started watching Bean Squad. really didn't kind of like them at first, but the more I watched and, you know, it was like, hmm, this kind of all right, you know? And it was just sad yesterday, y'all, uh, them putting up, like, they, I don't know if they'll probably still be doing vlogs and things, but With them have to, you know what I'm saying, go through the process that they're going through for as, you know what I'm saying, jail time. And, you know, they have never been apart from each other. And now Billy has to serve two years. And then when he come out, Eva got to serve, I think it's like a year and 30 days or something like that. It's rough and it's hard, you know, because you, you come from, and that's a lot of people, y'all. Because I'm not going to even say them. Some of us, you have that past life where you have done things and you know things that you have done. You know it's not right. But you you look at the money. You get what I'm saying? Like, this is the money that I'm getting right now and I need this money. So, this is what I'm doing. And then, at the end of the day, you feel like it ain't going to catch up or however. And it could be years later and that shit really catches up to you. And... It's more hard to digest and look at because it's like, damn, you know what I'm saying? I was younger then, now I done 
started my family. You know what I'm saying? I'm pregnant and I got a baby girl and my son. And it just goes to, even though they were saying like, you know, it's good because yeah, they could have got a lot of years behind it. But one year and two years is really not bad. But when you already have kids and you just used to the foundation that you own and in, it don't matter if they give you 60 days. It's still going to be hard. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> it's going to be hard. And I hate to hear that, y'all. But at the same time, you know, I know that they passed, passed and they tried to just move forward from it. But. Like I say, y'all, y'all never know what come back and bite you in your ass. You never know. And I remember, like, when I was younger, <clears throat> like, uh, my kid folk, he will always try to, you know what I'm saying, come up with these different licks. And you know when you, 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 you have somebody telling you, like, man, I got this lick, you know what I'm saying, you can get this type of money and this type of money and this. It make you feel like, you know what I'm saying, ooh, I'm going to try that. But you have to always think like, shit out here ain't for free. It's not. Even the money that you get paid and the money that you get, they give you, you still got to give that shit back. You get what I'm saying? You can keep some of it, but at the end of the day, you still got to give that shit back. I feel it's nothing out here for free. And all these little schemes and slick shit to come up with some hustle and money real fast. That shit come back and bite you in your ass. It really do. You know, and that hustle that they had back then. It was bringing in the money. And that's the same thing, like, you know what I'm saying, like my kinfolk used to do. But it's like, you know, you don't never know what's going to catch up. Yeah, you know the government got a lot of money. Yeah, you know. But that shit will catch up with you. But at that moment, you don't think about all that. You just think about the money that you're getting and what's what. And that was back then, like, shit, they'll try to get you in on it. Like, damn, you know what I'm saying? You you can get all this money back. Or if you do it this way, you I'm talking about thousands and thousands. You get what I'm saying? And I was always scared. Like, <laughs> I ain't finna do that shit. I'm not gonna do that shit. Because you don't know, you don't never know how it's gonna come back and get you. And I just feel bad for the kids, you know? Because they gonna have a time frame that they not gonna have their father. Somebody that they done been around every day. And then they going to have a time frame that they not going to be around their mother. Somebody that they done been around every day. You know what I'm saying? And the same goes for him and the same goes for her. Either way, it ain't no way around it. The shit is still hard. You get what I'm saying? But as they said, you right. You know what I'm saying? It's consequences for your actions. It is. And even though that's way back then and we at this moment, we still have to suffer the consequences for what we did back then. And I was so surprised for them to come out with it and actually tell the people, you know, that's, that was the crazy part. And it's like, dang, you know, but it just shows you, you know, it doesn't matter who get on this YouTube platform and they can have the most money, but you, you don't know people backgrounds. You don't know what they've been through. You don't, you don't know what they done done. You don't know none of that. We only know what we see. And the first time they got on here and they start telling about it, I was shocked. Like, what? Eva? Billy, they don't even seem like that kind. But, as they say, don't let the face fool you, okay? And that's what's up. But I just, you know, at the end of the day, like I said, I feel for the kids. I feel for them too, you know what I'm saying? Because if Eva and Billy done been around each other, Ooh, and he tried so hard not to cry, y'all. But she couldn't help it. She cried. I cried, too. Because when you done been around somebody so long, you ain't never been separated. And y'all got to be separated. I ain't talking about for a day or two or a week or two or a month or two. I'm talking about a year or two. That's hard. And as far as my kids, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to have a... You know what? She got time. But by the time he have to go in, the baby, the, the unborn baby, at least be going on two or somewhere around there it's just sad y'all like that kind of made me feel like i was all into the tv like damn you know they always say just because you got the money 
know what I'm saying? It's always repercussions behind it. And why the hell they keep slamming those? Yeah, y'all. So if y'all haven't checked out Watch Beam Squad, I'm pretty sure if y'all watch Beam Squad, put in the comments down below. I watch them right along with CJ. So cool, y'all. <laughs> faithfully okay those are big youtuber channels that i watch faithfully okay i can go down the list and tell y'all who i watch faithfully other big youtubers but for as them i got them from my baby from super Sire. you know what i'm saying and i got hooked on beam squad and that was just kind of sad to hear yesterday y'all so I know sometimes we might be in situations and you know what I'm saying, we need that quick money, okay? And we don't worry we we don't worry about okay, where this money coming from. We know what we doing with this money is wrong. Sometimes you got to think about it cuz you don't never know how it might creep up on you or affect you. You get what I'm saying? I'm just saying. Y'all, I'm always doing my hands up like this. Anyways, y'all, this was a basic, like a little light reaction, but a chat. You know what I'm saying? More, you know what I'm saying? Bringing y'all in. You know what I'm saying? Oh, y'all see my hair color? It's, 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 y'all see that, right? It's got its own thing going on, but I kind of, I, I kind of like it. Cause it ain't just, you know, you got the, y'all see, you got the lighter, you got the darker. I like that. <laughs> it is what it is. So, anyways, y'all, if y'all like this video, let's throw them video. If y'all like this video, let's throw them the thumbs up. And if y'all have not, as y'all do, subscribe because it's Lala. Peace.